I love the new trailer. They really shocked us, straight to the bone. I mean, you had to hand it to them. They got to the point really fast. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. Nice chest. No, 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 chest, chest. So a new adventure is on the horizon, well actually pretty close to the horizon, it's, it's coming out tomorrow, and it's all sorts of bony. This now explains why Tasha at Ancient Spires has been acting so weirdly lately. So it's pretty obvious given the name of the new adventure, the key art for it and the Briggsy memorabilia, that the storyline is going to revolve around the skeleton that never asked to be cursed. Briggsy, to our knowledge, is the only skeleton who actively went looking for a cure and she was pretty close. She wasn't necessarily evil, but was hell-bent on being cured and did everything she could to fulfill that agenda, even vanquishing peaceful crews along her way. Her voyage for the pursuit of a cure eventually led her to the shores of gold. Yes, indeed. She got there long before any of us. The Shores of Gold Tall Tale Journal is mostly written by her. Once there, she met with a gold hoarder who promised her a cure for her curse, but refused to give it to her until she started working for him. Of course, blinded by the idea that she could once again feel the sea air on her face and taste a good warm meal, she did just that. But her story was never fully told because we blundered her in the face for a cosmetic price. But it appears that Tasha has found even more clues tucked away in Briggsy's journal. When Tasha was a child, she often went on adventures with Briggsy before she was cursed, and was often told amazing stories about her exploits in the Sea of Thieves. Because of this, Tasha looks up to Briggsy as an idol. Even though Briggsy was cursed, Tasha believed there was still good in her. But now, it appears even Tasha herself is beginning to suffer the same fate as her hero. Now, I have no doubt at all that this new adventure will be another case of pick thing up, go take thing to thing, hand in, get a new figurehead, and such like, but the story surrounding this new story arc is very interesting. Will Tasha become a new Wanda the Warsmith, or will Briggsy's story finally be finished, and a cure for the curse found? The latter is far more interesting, because if a cure is found, there is possibly several cursed pirates out there that would be interested in turning back to their former lives. As a skeleton, you have two options, join the Dark Brethren or join Flameheart. Or I guess you could just chill out in the Sea of the Damned, but given the choice to reverse the curse, I think we could see a significant shift in power, and possibly a redemption story arc for some very well-known lore characters. We could even see the cure for the curse used as a weapon to end the reign of other very well-known characters. But this new story arc brings up another question. As we have seen with the last two story arcs, they always end in a choice. The pattern is usually four adventures centered around a certain shift in the story, ending in a community choice where the results finally make their way to the game. So if the story is very much centered around Briggsy, could it be possible that the ending of this story arc down the line could see us either bringing Briggsy back to flesh and blood and be a fighting force for Athena or remain cursed and join the Reapers. Remember that Briggsy isn't actually dead. She was stopped, yes, and is nothing more than a skull now, but she wasn't killed. So a redemption story arc for Briggsy, whether it be to live on as a cursed pirate or be reunited with her skin, could very possibly be a thing in future updates. Anyway, the update is out tomorrow and we'll finally get to see which direction this story is taking us. A much shorter video today guys, I just wanted to give people a little backstory to Briggsy before you all go delving into this new adventure. More revelations and more teasers coming in next week. Until then, safe sailing and stop looking at this chest. No, this chest.